Well, we are the station that holds people in power accountable, and for over a week now, we've been trying to get more information on the COVID-19 clusters across western New York. Now, Governor Cuomo has commented on those clusters and told western New York that we are under a caution flag. Two on your side's Claudine Ewing is live outside the Rath Building in downtown Buffalo to tell us more. Claudine? When the caution flag is waved, that means listen up. And according to the governor today, there is an uptick in cases here in Western New York. He says that there have been several clusters in Western New York. In Erie County specifically, he said there is a steel plant. He also highlighted some new cases at two nursing homes where workers uh, must be tested. Also, pre-hospital procedures have shown an increase in positive cases and testing of seasonal labor at farms. Two on your side did file free of information requests asking for more information on the locations in Erie County. We reached out to the county executive's office as well as the health commissioner's office. As of right now, no specific information has been released for us to release to you, the public. Meanwhile, in Chautauqua County, there is a food processing plant where the governor said there is a cluster. The county executive there did address the media late this afternoon. Now I can confirm that 22 of our current 31 cases of COVID-19 are related to Field Brook Farms in Dunkirk. Upon identifying a potential cluster of cases, the county has been working with Field Brook's local management as well as Wells Enterprises based in Iowa, the corporate office to mitigate further spread and to review their COVID-19 safety and screening protocols. They have been very cooperative in their efforts, including collaborating with Chautauqua County and New York State Departments of Health to conduct COVID-19 testing for all employees at their Dunkirk facility. Chautauqua County officials uh, said they became aware of this incident at this food processing plant around August 16th. There is also going to be a testing clinic in Chautauqua County. Uh, as we mentioned, or what we heard today is that 15 new cases in Chautauqua County since Friday, 10 of those cases came from that Fieldbrook's farm location. They expect more cases. That's what we heard today from the health commissioner down in Chautauqua County. Meanwhile, no specifics on the clusters here in Erie County. That's information that we've been trying to get from officials here at the Rath Building, where the county executive and the health commissioner are located. Reporting live in downtown Buffalo, Claudine Ewing, Channel 2 News. Thanks, Claudine, and some more on that. Again, according to the governor's announcement today that Western New York is being given a so-called caution flag because of the appearance of those clusters, Two on Your Side has filed additional Freedom of Information Law requests to get more specifics about the rise in cases. Even as recent as this afternoon, an update from Erie County did not provide locations of those recent outbreaks or other information that we believe the public needs to know. Now, this is all part of our effort to provide you the complete story and continue our pledge to hold people in power accountable.